my dearest Annie, my stake divine. <laughs> From the moment I laid eyes on you on that fateful evening of November 1st, 2017, I knew that you were the one. Your beauty, your joyfulness, your radiance, they all captivated me in a way that I cannot put into words. And as we got to know each other, it became clear that our backgrounds, though extremely different, only served to make us stronger together. Today, as I stand behind you, <laughs> or perhaps before you, I vow to cherish and love you for all eternity. I promise to support you in your dreams, to lift you up when you fall, and to be your rock in times of need. I will always strive to make you laugh, to make you smile, and to make your heart sing. I will be your partner in all things, your confidant, your best friend. I am making a vow to you and a promise to Jack and Claire to be there for you, to take good care of you, to love you, and to celebrate every single seconds of your life. My beautiful, cheerful queen, I give you my heart and my soul. I promise to walk by your side through all of life's up and down and to love you more deeply with each passing day. I'm forever grateful that our paths have crossed and I look forward to spending the rest of my life with you. I love you, babe. With the blessing of God, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, we surround you with your light and protect your coming and going. Your hand must always bring you great blessings for yourself and for your husband and your future children. In Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you, Mama. Thank you, Mama. I love you, Mama. Thank you so much. Thank you. You're welcome to our family with all the whole love in the world. Thank you so much for loving my son this way. This well. We want to thank the two of you for reminding us that it's our call too to bring out and reveal what's already there in one another. Great goodness. These are dads. Her dads, yeah. Her dad has always wanted for like you know, since since he passed. to bring out that goodness that's in each one of us. And the two of you do that in a really special way. Charlie, today is a day I never could have imagined existing in my wildest dreams. It's a dream I never want to wake up from. This dream is beautiful and complex, vivid and adventurous, patient and kind. It's filled with unique characters, scenes from around the world, culture, charisma, and the coziest of times. In this dream, you are my guiding light, taking me to places of growth I never imagined for myself. You put the pieces back together when they crumble. You create a foundation that I can launch from. You honor me, believe in me, encourage me. But none of it is a dream. It's a very blessed love story from our angels above who brought us together to make that dream a reality. Thank you for choosing me, Charlie, for loving me, honoring me exactly as I am, respecting me. Thank you for being my best friend, standing by my side when I need you the most, 
or right behind me as I drive us forward. I often think about how my mom and dad would feel about all of this, and I know they would have adored you. I feel confident knowing they and your mom are looking down on us. They are here with us today and they are lighting our path forward. May we always honor that path. May we always respect one another in all the good times and all the bad. As your wife, I vow to be a true partner to you. I vow to challenge you, believe in you, and amplify the amazing person you are. I love you with my entire soul, and I am so grateful this dreamy day exists. Charles, do you take Anne for your lawful wife to have and to hold for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, until death do you part? Yes, I do. I do. And receive this ring. Charles, receive this ring. And now I introduce to you the newest married couple in the entire universe, Mr. and Mrs. Ishola. How amazing it's been the past couple days to meet and talk with all of your guys' family and friends, some that I have not met before. And I can genuinely say everyone that I have spoken with has been so kind, so loving, so fun, such genuine people. And I think it's such a testament to who you guys are by the circle of people that you have surrounded by your life. Annie and Charlie, as you begin the next chapter together, as husband and wife, remember that this room is filled with all of the people who support you, who love you, and care for you. To love, laughter, and your happily ever after. I love you. This speech was very difficult for me to write because there aren't enough words to describe how amazing Annie and Charlie are. Annie is the most important person to Charles and he does everything he can to make her happy, even the little things. Um, so Annie is one of the sweetest people I know and she continues to make Charles a better man. If I tell you again, I true, say your body be finite. And the way to make a movie. The first time that Charles introduced Annie to me, you could just see the glow in his face. He was so, so excited. And I knew that this guy is gonna put in more than 100% for this lady. Annie, you look amazing. You look beautiful. I'm happy that I know you. I'm happy that you're in our lives. And I know that you have a big heart. Everyone here has been crying. Some of you haven't been crying. Uh, but it's all a testament to how sweet and loving you are. And I know that you're going to carry this into this marriage. And Charles is also going to meet you right there. Annie, Elizabeth, Ishola. You, uh, you've been welcome since, you know that? Right from the one, even before I met you. But now I'm formally saying, welcome home, daughter. 
This is your clan. This is your tribe. We're all here for you too and the love we celebrate with you today. To the two of you, now and forever, may you have a long and prosperous life together. Amen. If I talk to visit us again